What's up everyone? Happy Sunday fun day. It is a beautiful Sunday here in Long Island, New York. The sun is shining. It's got to be like 60 degrees already. Down here by the water in East Rockaway. Down there by Lazy Lobster, who is starting to open up. Uh, pretty awesome sight to see. Uh, they're taking all the shrink wrap off of everything and uh, starting to do the spring cleanup. So, signs of life over at Lazy Lobster. Can't wait to go hang out over there. It's always a fun place. Then you got Grandpa Tony's Pizza over here with the outside patio. Uh, two great places over here. There's an auction sign on the front of the reel. So, that uh, obviously isn't opening this year. Uh, but this is a great area to hang out down here in East Rockaway, uh, Long Island, New York. Good summer spot down here. And um, we get your message of the day. So, uh, I had my daughter's uh, communion yesterday. And uh, we're doing a party today down at Kennedy's in Breezy Point. Uh, awesome day for it. Looking forward to that. Uh, I think I might break the Camaro out and go down there cruising with the top down. So I want to get the bike right out of the way this morning. And um, I was thinking about it. Um, that song by Chumbawamba back in the day. I get, knock I get knocked down, but I get up again. Um, that's like a real story of life. Like we constantly get knocked down. Life isn't fair. Stuff's going to happen to us. Um... And the biggest, uh, most important part of life is how we come back, how we get up again. Because we can get knocked down and we can stay down and we can be sorry for ourselves. And we can complain and we can say life's not fair. Or we can get up again and we can start over. We can start fresh. Um, and we can just start going again. Um, life is a series of rises and falls. Um, just like the economy, roughly every 10 years the economy rises and falls. We've been on a good run, but it's cyclical, right? You're going to have good times, and you're going to have bad times. And when the bad times come, um, your recovery, your response, your rebuild is the most important part. Because it's really easy to feel sorry for yourself. It's really easy to say, this isn't fair. It's really easy to say, uh, I can't catch a break. But at the end of the day, um, God has a plan for you. You got to have faith. You got to surround yourself with the right people. We talk about this a lot. And you got to have confidence and know that you can do anything you want to do. So the longer you sit and wait and complain and feel sorry for yourself, uh, the longer it's going to take for you to get back into good times, back onto the seat and back into the saddle again, as they say. Um, we all have that choice. Every morning we can wake up and we can say, poor, I don't feel good. Um, you know, this isn't, uh, this isn't working for me. Or you could say, you know what? I'm blessed. The sun is out. The weather is warm. And we're here to uh, see another day and try again. And it's really just a conscious effort, a conscious choice you need to make. Everybody's got problems in their life. Everyone gets knocked down. It's just, are you going to stay down or are you going to get back up again? Just think about that song. I get knocked down, but I get up again and get up again. Get up again every day. Get up again every day and win. And uh, your life will be better for it. So think about that. Think about what you're telling yourself. Are you telling yourself, I can't? You're telling yourself, I can't catch a break? You're telling yourself, um, I can't get an opportunity? Or are you getting up every day and trying to win? There's a big difference. All right, so let's jump on prayers. Look at that sunshine. It's awesome. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to get up again. Help us to know that uh, that faith, and know that you are in control, that you have a plan for our lives, and that there's no plan B, that this is plan A. And uh, the plan is in front of us. We just need to tackle it. Uh, help us to not feel sorry for ourselves, and help us to be go-givers, because um, the more we can give to others, the more we help ourselves in the process. Amen. All right. Mm -hmm. Sunday, fun day. This thing's still trying to uh, calculate on my Strava app. Um, again, we're over here by Lazy Lobster. So you can see over there, they're taking down the uh, wrap on everything. Uh, getting ready to go for the season. That is awesome. Signs of life. This was a really long winter. 
I don't know if it was just because I was out riding my bike so much in the cold, but this winter seemed like it wouldn't go away. And uh, Lazy Lop, I mean, uh, the reel's over there, and there's an auction sign on the front of that, so if you're looking to buy a restaurant, there's an opportunity there. And then you got Grandpa Tony's over here. They just built this outside patio last year. Uh, some great places to hang out over here in East Rockaway. This is uh, Take Ocean Avenue all the way down to the end, and you'll hit this. If you keep going, you go to Bay Park, which is another awesome place to hang out. I'm blessed here on Long Island to have so many cool spots to uh, to go to, to live around the water so close. Um, a lot of us take it for granted, but it really is a blessing to have so many cool places around. Um, real Estate World, uh, Rockville Center. We did an open house yesterday. Uh, it's six bedroom, three bath, 3,000 square feet. Um, I think I have some offers coming in. Two people said they were making offers, but wait and see what comes in on them. And the listing I just did in Plainview, we already have offers on that. We're going to do uh, a showing tomorrow. That's basically investor property. So that house is listed at six seventy nine. There's a house two doors down that just sold for a million four fifty one. So if you're a builder, if you're an investor, um, that's an opportunity there. It's a sixteen hundred and twelve square foot ranch. So you put a second floor on it. You got thirty two hundred square feet, and uh, you know do it five bedrooms, three baths, and you're gonna have a million four house too, uh, based on a six seventy nine initial build, and uh, you know a couple hundred to put a top on it and uh there's some meat on the bone there so <clears throat> i already have offers on that uh, we're gonna do best and final by the end of day on uh tomorrow and um aside from that i got some other things in the works um basically everything's going as fast as it comes out elmont's in contract west Hempstead's in contract uh, i'm supposed to be closing 120 hanson this week i'm supposed to be closing uh farmers in belmore this week um what else do we got going on um a couple others Oh, Croydon is in Malvern is going to close about two weeks. So there's a lot going on in the real estate world. Um, I try not to bore you too much with that, but uh, if you need anything in the real estate world, um, rates are climbing. So if you're thinking of selling, sell now. There's a little bit of buyer frenzy right now. People are buy before the rates get any higher. Don't know how long that is going to last. Uh, if you're looking to buy, same thing. Let's buy before the rates get any higher. Um, we're here to help. I got a team of about a dozen of us here uh, looking to make your home ownership dreams come true and looking to help you sell that property and get top dollar for it quickly um so all right everyone you know how to find me i'm here brian lewis the brian lewis team at exp realty uh with day 335 of this 365 day journey and we got 30 days left finish line is near um and the weather is here so thank god because i was really getting tired of riding in the cold it's been windy and cold for like ever so i know complaining Screw my excuses, but whatever. Here it is, sunshine, fun day, Sunday. Celebrating my daughter's first communion today and uh, all good stuff. So put your head on a pillow every night knowing you're making the world a better place. Fire starts fire, let's go. Happy Sunday, go enjoy, get outside.